ladies and gentlemen professor dg harendra de silva prof harendra as we use to call him does not need any introduction to this august gathering he is an emeritus professor of pediatrics university of colombo prof qualified from the university of colombo in 1975 he started his career as an intern house officer in the ladridge hospital and like most of us steadily climbed his way to the ladder after completing his local training in pediatrics he proceeded to his foreign training in the uk he worked as a research fellow and a registrar at birmingham children hospital shortly after his return he joined the department of pediatrics faculty of medicine university of rohna in 1983 as a senior lecturer i believe the rest is history in his star studded career he held every possible position as a pediatrician can hold in lifetime a very few of them include professor of pediatrics university of rohna from 1992 to 1999 professor of pediatrics university of kalania february 1992 to april 2015 professor of pediatrics university of colombo april 2015 to january 2017 chairman board of study in pediatrics post graduate institute of medicine university of colombo from 2007 to 2010 president slcp 1998 to 1999 president of slmc 2019 to 2021 he has so many accolades to his distinguished career which are far too numerous to mention here in this short introduction some of them i selected include fellow of royal college of physicians london in 1993 fellow of royal college of physicians edinburgh 1994 elected fellow of the royal college of pediatrics and child health in 1997 most outstanding asian pediatrician 2003 distinguished career award by the international society against child abuse 2006 vidya jyoti national award for excellence in scientific research in 2017 professor inexhaustible researcher he has published widely in both national and international journals throughout his distinguished career in this list of publication he was the first person to report many diseases in sri lankan context the list started with a reporting case of infantile glaucoma associated with neonatal rubella in cmj in 1976 since then prof has published over 100 research and review articles in prestigious mm-hmm. journals including archives of diseases childhood bmj jpgn gart lancet gastroenterology and hepatology and child abuse and neglect his research interest has been extensive some of them include diarrheal diseases helminthic infection cytokine profile in children with dysentery child abuse child soldiers thyroid diseases and dengue i must say he has not stopped yet and i believe the best is yet to come as he has more time to right now he is a person who firmly believes in a principle that i vital to any researcher he practices what he find in research and put them into ultimate benefit of human kind i can give you an example of this when he found child abuse prevailing in the country he created several awareness programs formed the national child protection authority to fight against child abuse he became its founder chairman and created many laws to protect children from abuse neglect and domestic labor not stopping there he wrote so many books books chapters creating songs written stories and made some famous posters to prevent child abuse and neglect he started he stands for social justice i have seen him engaging in many fights against social injustice alone as a hard rock 
Apart from his scientific writing, he has written many newspaper articles on various social problems in this country and fought against them. Prof has many talents, far too numerous to mention here. He has created songs and short stories to prevent child abuse. As you all are well aware, he is a, one of the best photographers in the country. I have seen him engaging in bonsai, and he used to be a keen gardener when he was living in Gaul. If he can find a moment of break in his busy schedule, he will be in a jungle with his camera. On a personal note, I was one of his students at University of Rogona. My career would not have been unfold like this if I didn't meet him in that crucial junction. I wanted to become, join the Department of Parasitology as a demonstrator after finishing my final MBBS. He forced me to join his team in 1996. Prof taught me the value of research, allowed me to do some and guided me through them. He encouraged me to select an academic career when I was wondering what to do in my youth. He guided me, challenged me, and protected me when I was troubled in more than one occasion. I must clearly state it here that I would not be the 25th president of the SLCP or the professor of pediatrics University of Colombo if I did not have valuable guidance from him. This is the very reason, ladies and gentlemen, I wanted him to be the chief guest of this occasion. With that note, I would kindly invite Prof. Harendra De Silva to the podium. 